Um, we were planning our next uh, cultural day out, and we wanted to go to the Erwin, Erwin Elephant Museum, which we're going to do. And I thought, well, where can we do as well? And a few weeks ago, my friend Dow was driving us around, and I came past this place, and we're just down the road from Erwin. So I suggested we got far with us, and my usual cameraman Steve. So I said, what do you think? Anyway, we went inside. This is what Steve thought. So mate, what do you reckon? So well, mate, what do you reckon? Well, we've just been here today to the Royal Navy Museum. Excellent! You can see it's over there. Okay, the building is a little massive. It was free and there's loads to see. And there was a, a guy who showed us around. He spoke a little bit of English. He spoke a lot of types of farm. He said she explained to us what happened. And we thought, oh, we'll only be here for 30 minutes. We must have been here nearly two hours. It was absolutely brilliant, and it was so helpful. And there's lots to see inside it. Anybody who's interested in anything like this, it's free. Get on the sky train, get over here. The Royal Navy, Thai stop. Come here, you, you can't go wrong. Great day out. Great. If you've got kids, great to bring kids. Yeah, great I can't recommend it enough. Um, the, the serving officer who rode in the boats was there. Uh... Yes, one of the guys who, if you ever watch the boat procession in time where they, they do the rowing, he tells us how they have to do it. They have to do it like a bird. It's like a bird to do the boats. And it goes like that, so it's flying, and then it goes back down, and it goes back down. He explained all that to us, and he's a stocky little guy, and he says he, he goes, 52 boats. 52, in the there are, yeah. 52 in the procession. How, long, how, how often do they do it? Every two or three years, he says? Every two or three years. And Far says that she's watched it before, she always turns it off. After coming here today, she says she'll definitely watch it next time. Well, Hopefully. Yeah, we'll go. Let's go there. Yeah, Hopefully. yeah. But I couldn't recommend this enough. Great place. Yeah. Yeah, as you say, mate, it's dead easy if, you, if you're in town and you're a bit bored. Yeah. You know, you want to kill a couple of hours, it's straight on the Sky Train from Assok. Straight down here to Assok. About oh, ten stops. Get off there, the Sky Train. And it's there. Right at the Sky Train stop, it's there. I yeah. Recommend it enough. Great stuff, mate. Thanks a lot.
I say, what I do, but I'm hurt away off of my shoes, and don't you. So, it's a few days after we've done this, but it's only right that we finish this video off to not leave it at a loose scent. So, there's no fire up with us at the moment, which is probably a relief to our livers. So I'm going to talk through the, um, the review of the Erwin Elephant Museum. So Steve, what was your initial thoughts? Price, was it worth it? 400 baht for you and I, 250 baht for fire. So we're only paying 150 baht more than a tie. So I'd say yeah, I'd, I'd say it was worth it. Um, now, I'm going to ask a few different questions on it so we get through it reasonably quick in between the break here. We've just watched a mammoth act here in this lovely bar up in uh, the Sandmire area, which we do recommend by the way, the Craft House. Um, back to the uh, museum, the, the first part, the gardens, what do you oh, think beautiful. to that? Really well maintained, beautiful gardens, yeah, very peaceful, very tranquil, but yeah, great gardens. Uh, the elephant monuments, bit of a shock when you walk under them. Yeah, they are, because they've got like a, uh, uh, what is it, it's like a, I can't think of the word, you walk underneath, and it's, sensor. Like, it's, it's like a sensor, <coughs> makes an elephant noise, you keep walking with each elephant, makes a different noise, each elephant has a different name, yeah. so yeah, it's, it's good. I thought Nelly looked love like. Big and, trunk. Yes, yes, and then you go inside the building, of course. Unbelievable. The ceiling, the stairs, the, the statue, unbelievable, beautiful. A bit of a climb to the top when you get in the elephant torso. Very much so. Uh, we walked all the way up where we could have got the lift. We walked all the, you can get the lift if you want to be lazy. We walked all the way to the top. No air conditioning, so it's very hot. And the roof when you get up to the, to the ceiling. Incredible. I did something I shouldn't have done. I took a video. Maybe Rob will show you later, but it, oh, the ceiling's unbelievable, fantastic, and yet again, it's like we're in the, the elephant's trunk. Yeah, beautiful place. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm far wanting to go there for ages. Oh yeah, I don't know. It was worth it for her. For years and years, we've gone past it on the way to Ohio. So to last Thursday, we got the chance to go there. Well worth it. And then we. I, show, I introduce you to Bolt Taxis, a new innovation. One of the driver got a bit of a shock, didn't they? Taking us where he had to go. Yes, when he realised where we were going, he was like, he asked far in time, do they mind if I use the tollway? The Bolt Taxi was really cheap. So from where we were, which is quite a long way to Bangkok P, it was 206 baht. But we had to use the tollway, it's like a little bit Maybe another 60, 70 bar. Yeah. yeah. Which we didn't mind. It got us there a lot quicker. Yeah, yeah. And then on the drama bar. Can you remember much? No. That's good. That's this is good. why the video is late. It is indeed. We were going to do the video first at the museum, but then the bolt taxi turned up. Yeah. And then at drama, and the music was a bit loud. Yeah, well, I don't know if the music was a bit loud, but... We were. I, yeah, well, we were a bit loud. There's us three, and you, Far and I, and then my friend Chris turned up, and we had a few drinks, and then we had a good deal, and then we spoke to the guy, he gives another good deal. So we had 16 bottles of Y beer, which is a great drink, by the way. Yeah. Large bottles, large by the way, bottles, by oh, the way which we share out. Big some, bottles. Some drink more and, quicker than and, others. And because he knew we was going to have a few drinks, free ice. Yeah. Now, yeah, you want ice, you want ice, no problem. Uh, but somebody knocked the ice over. Uh, yeah, the cameraman was a, the current cameraman, not the usual cameraman, was a little bit uh, flamboyant yes. by that stage of the but, evening. But, oh, on a personal note, I really suffer the next day. Well, I'm going to string along a video of me at the end of that night impersonating Elvis, which will show you the kind of condition I ended up in. Fortunately, you and Far went home, which is probably a blessing for you. But yeah, great day. Um, with the Navy Museum, Erwan Elephant Museum, and then the bar at Bank Cafe. 
funny slide of the day I mentioned it to you earlier today Faz and you've been such a good guide Blob it's a miracle yeah she did she, did go. she says to me she says Mr Bernard seems to know where he's going but he doesn't really <laughs> and then she says to me that's the says, story of my life she says she says oh today you've been a good guide Rob it's a miracle <laughs> uh, but the miracle is how we got home yeah yeah indeed yeah, there'll be another adventure coming soon, folks. Yes. We've, we've got a list, we're drawing lists up now, and we've, I think we've built for about another three months of adventure. Yeah, yeah. a couple of recommendations. Yeah. Got some good ones lined up. Oh, yes. Over the next few, not well, coming months. And if they don't come off, there's always the bar at Banker Pay. Yes. Or the bar, or the, if I may put my favourite local, Pinot Pong Blue in at uh, Minbury, where I, I, I play live some nights. On a, go, on a different note, we would we drank 16 bottles of beer and it didn't even come to, it came to about 25 quid Yeah, yeah. for 16 bottles of beer. Large bottles, not the, oh, not not the, the big bottles. Ones. The big bottles. Yeah, yeah. Not the big bottles you pay a lot for downtown. No. These were big bottles. Yeah. So, and the deal was that we bought 16 bottles, so we, we actually saved 10 bar a bottle. Every, every bar counts in, our, in my book. It certainly does. Yeah, it was a great, great game. Yeah. I'd recommend the, the Naval Museum. I'd recommend the, the Elephant, which you will go past every time you go to a win. Yeah. You will have seen it. And I'd definitely recommend a drink in the drama bar. Great stuff. Yeah. Well, that concludes that, folks. We'll try and get the next one out a bit quicker.